Welcome back to Infigyan, my dear friends. In this video, we have one very interesting question from algebra. We have to solve x square minus 4x minus 3 whole cube equal to negative 8x cube for the real values of x. So let's get started. I will check our equation at x equal to 0. So I can write 0 square minus 4 times 0 minus 3 whole cube equal to negative 8 times 0 cube. So LHS will give us minus 3 whole cube and RHS will be 0. So minus 27 is not equal to 0. So we can conclude x cannot be 0 for our equation. So I can write x can't be 0. Now I will divide both sides by x cube. x square minus 4x minus 3 whole cube divided by x cube equal to negative 8x cube over x cube. Now x cube and x cube will be over. I can write our equation x square minus 4x minus 3 whole cube over x cube equal to negative 8. Now we know the property from exponents a power n over b power n. We can write a over b whole power n. So I can write x square minus 4x minus 3 over x and then whole cube equal to negative 8. Now I can write x square over x minus 4x over x minus 3 over x whole cube and RHS is negative 8. So this will give us x minus 4 minus 3 over x whole cube equal to negative 8. Or I can write x minus 3 over x minus 4 whole cube equal to negative 8. Now we can use substitution. So I will consider x minus 3 over x equal to a. So our equation will be a minus 4 whole cube equal to negative 8. Now I will add 8 to both sides. So I can write here plus 8, plus 8. So this will be 0. I can write a minus 4 whole cube plus 8 equal to 0 or a minus 4 whole cube plus 2 cube equal to 0. Now we can use a cube plus b cube formula. So let me write m cube plus n cube formula. It is equal to m plus n times m square plus n a square minus m n. Here m is a minus 4 and n is 2. So I can write a minus 4 whole cube plus 2 cube equal to 0. I will write in one bracket a minus 4 plus 2. In other bracket, a minus 4 whole square plus 2 whole square and minus times 2 times a minus 4 equal to 0. So a minus 2 times a minus 4 whole square. So we can write a square minus 8a plus 16, 2 square is 4, 
minus 2 times a minus 2a minus 2 times minus 4 plus 8 equal to 0. Or we can write a minus 2 times a square minus 10a 20 plus 8 20a equal to 0. So we can conclude either a minus 2 will be equal to 0 or a square minus 10a plus 28 equal to 0. Let's solve both the equations. So from this equation a minus 2 equal to 0, I will get a equal to 2. Now this is one quadratic equation. I can use quadratic formula. Let me write here a square minus 10a plus 28 equal to 0. So I will write a equal to minus b. So minus of minus 10 plus minus square root of minus 10 is square minus 4 times 1 times 28 over 2 times 1 which will give us plus 10 plus minus square root of negative 10 square is 100 minus 4 times 28 it is 112 over 2 10 plus minus square root negative 12 over 2 or I can write 10 plus minus i times 2 root 3 over 2. Or we can write 5 plus minus i root 3. Because the square root of negative 1 is i. So solution is complex. We can reject easily. So we can reject this solution. Now we will accept a equal to 2 only. Now a was our substitution x minus 3 over x was a equal to 2. Now I will multiply both sides by x. So I can write here x square minus 3 equal to 2x or x square minus 2x minus 3 equal to 0. I can write x square minus 2x and 3 I will take to the RHS as plus 3. Let's add 1 to both sides. So LHS will give us x minus 1 whole square and RHS is 4. 4 can be written as 2 square. Now I will consider a square root both sides. So a square root and a square root. So a square root and a square will be cancelled out from both sides and we will be writing x minus 1 equal to plus minus 2. After adding 1 from both sides, I will write here 1 plus minus 2 x will come out 3 and negative 1. So here we have two solutions x equal to 3 and x equal to negative 1. So we will be checking here. Let's check x equal to 3. Equation is written here. Let me apply directly 3 square. So I will write 9 minus 4 times 3 so 12 minus 3 whole cube and RHS at x equal to 3 minus 8 times 3 cube is 27. Now I will write 9 minus 3 is 6, 6 minus 12 is negative 6 whole cube equal to minus 216. So LHS will become minus 216, RHS is also minus 216, 
that means x equal to 3 is verified solution. Now I'll check x equal to negative 1. So I will write negative 1 is square 1 minus 4 times negative 1. So plus 4 minus 3 whole q equal to negative 8 times negative 1 q. So 5 minus 3 this is 2 cube. RHS is negative 8 times negative 1. LHS is 8. RHS is also 8. That means it is true. X equal to negative 1 is also verified solution. And this is the end of the video friends. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Till next video. Take care of yourself. Bye-bye.